Inflation continues to fall, but are people here in the Triangle noticing any difference? CBS 17's Gilat Malamed is live at the State Farmers Market talking to shoppers. Gilat, what would you find out? Well, several shoppers tell me that they prefer the prices here at the state farmer's market compared to the prices at the grocery store. Inflation numbers released this week show food prices really haven't changed much since last month, but compared to last year, they rose about 10%. At the State Farmer's Market, David Robinson says... You get a little bit more for your bucks here than the grocery store. And that's important to him and pretty much all shoppers we spoke to. Meat, I don't buy meat anymore. I come and get vegetables and eat the vegetables. Meat is out of control. Farmer's Market regular Debbie Thome also prefers here. the prices here. Grocery prices have, have significantly gone up. Well, she says rent prices are astounding, too, when it comes to the economy overall. I think things are, are stabilizing. The latest numbers from the Bureau of Labor Statistics show inflation fell for the sixth straight month. I hear about it going down, but I, don't, I haven't seen it. Helen Wise of Wise Farm says the price of fertilizer and even those plastic bags she packs your produce in are having an impact. They go up every time we get them. So we have to go up and... Um, so we can stay in business. Speaking of prices going up, we got two dozen jumbo. According to the Consumer Price Index, eggs cost 60% more than a year ago. But the price of eggs going up lately and everybody complaining and trying to find places to get a good price for eggs. And we thought, you know what, they're locally grown here and put some money back in the local economy. Few feel it more. <laughs> Than the owner of Tapui Donuts. Alejandro Contreras says he buys at least 15 dozen eggs a week. He says three weeks ago he purchased 18 eggs for around $5 wholesale. Now it's seven or eight dollars. I'm paying more, but I'm not earning more money. A business owner feels he simply can't charge any more for his donuts. By the way, out of all the food items that are broken down in the Consumer Price Index, eggs had the largest year-to-year -year percentage increase, and that's largely due to the avian flu outbreak. Ivan Raleigh, Kilat Malamed, CBS 17 News. All right, thanks, Claudia.